Thank you. I bring greetings from um, your sisters in Australia. Um, because we are so geographically distant, we often feel isolated from the world struggle for women's rights. So it's wonderful to be here with such strong and articulate women. Iran is the heart of the struggle for women's rights in the world today, particularly in, in the face of the growing uh, Islamic fundamentalism. But each of us have our own struggles in our own countries, as we've heard today. Um, I was fascinated to hear of what's been happening uh, in other countries. Um, <clears throat> I thought that we in Australia really had women's rights and that misogyny was a thing of the past. Australia, in fact, was the first country to where women won the vote. Um, they won the vote in South Australia in 1894, uh, and it was only in 1896 that New Zealand um, was the second country to, for women to have the vote. When we got, when we got our first woman prime minister uh, three years ago, we really felt that we had arrived as a country that accepted women's rights. However, name calling is not as bad as what happens to women in Iran, where imprisonment, torture and even execution uh, happens when women stand up for their rights. When we go back to our own countries, each of us should undertake to do one thing that will go towards overthrowing the mullahs. We don't have to all work on everything. We should think of one thing that we can do. Um, as the Icelandic women have pointed out, most of the world's media totally ignore the situation of women in Iran. In fact, most of the world's media totally ignore what is going on inside Iran. It is only because we get the uh, emails from our uh, comrades here uh, in Paris that we know about the executions, the daily executions, often in public, of people whose, uh, whose offences have been uh, simply um, supporting the, uh, the dissident TV network, for instance. Um, our media totally ignores this. Make sure, when you go back to your countries, that your media knows about the situation in Iran. Tell them about this conference. Write reports about uh, what's been going on here. Uh, tell them about the fate of the thousand women in Camp Liberty. So, um, as I said, I bring you great greetings from uh, Australia. Thank you very much.